All right, that was of course Gaurav Gogoi of uh, the Congress speaking about the situation in uh, Manipur. And as we speak about that, we have big news that's coming in that Manipur has been declared as a disturbed area. The AFSPA extended to the entire state and 19 police station areas have been exempted from the AFSPA. So that's the big breaking update that is coming in. In fact, just to tell our viewers about the notification that's also been... Uh, given by the government of uh, Manipur is that in the states, the governor of Manipur is of the opinion that the violent activities of various extremist insurgent groups warrant the use of the armed forces and aid of civil administration in the entire state of Manipur, except the areas falling under the jurisdiction of 19 police stations. What we're picking up is also as far as these details are coming in. All right. I do understand my colleague Shanti is joining me uh, for more inputs on this. Uh, Shanti, what can you tell us as far as the situation is concerned as of now in Manipur and with the latest with the fact that the government has declared the entire state as a disturbed area as well? It happened in uh, the month of May and since then there have been uh, acts of uh, violence that have been reported in uh, many parts of Manipur and seeing the disturbed areas now the Home Ministry has declared the entire Manipur region will be declared as a disturbed area starting from 1st of October, excluding 19 police stations that have been given in the list. And uh, this means that more security uh, usage can be done to maintain peace in these areas because uh, uh, so far we've seen that the Assam Rifles and the Indian Army, the local police authorities have been collaborating to uh, maintain peace. But still, there have been issues, there have been uh, incidents in various parts. We've seen how uh, the MHA has been uh, uh, viewing the situation and reviewing the situation. And now they have decided that now first, from 1st of October, uh, the Special Armed Forces Act will be uh, the implemented and uh, the disturbed area status will be uh, dealt uh, with in Manipur area, excluding the 19 police stations that have been listed. Right, Shivani, I appreciate you getting us those details as far as this uh, breaking development uh, is concerned with the fact that the Manipur government has declared the entire state a disturbed area, which means that the AFSPA Act has been extended to the entire state. Like my colleague Shivani was pointing out, this has been a notification um, from uh, the government of Manipur's home department in view of the same. Now, you know, this is, of course, with the fact that the state of Manipur, except the areas falling under the jurisdiction of 19 police stations, is what we're learning. So that's the breaking update that's coming in as far as this entire situation of Manipur is concerned. Um, just telling our viewers as well, as far as this notification is concerned, the state government, of course, has gone on to analyze the prevailing law and order situation and uh, in the notification going on to state that... Uh, it has a detailed assessment on the ground as the sister security agencies are preoccupied in the maintenance of law and order and it will uh, arrive at the, any conclusion or decision on such sensitive matters without detailed assessment, thereby not appropriate to review disturbed area status of the state at the moment is what we're picking up. So, um, which basically means as far as the notification is concerned that therefore in the exercise of the powers conferred by the Section 3 of the Armed Forces Special Powers Act, better known as the AFSPA Act, um, has amended from time to time. So the governor of Manipur... Uh, you know, has approved to declare the entire state of Manipur, excluding the areas falling under the jurisdiction of 19 police stations, um, which has been named as disturbed area for a period of six months with effect from the 1st of October, like my colleague Shivani was also pointing out. Um, in fact, these uh, 19 jurisdiction police stations include Imphal, Lamphel, City, Singjamai, Sekmal, Lamsung, Patsoi, Wangoi, Parompat, Hingang, Lamlal, Iribung, Limakong, Tobul, Bishnupur, Nambol, Moirang, Kaching and Jiribam. So those are the 19 police stations under the jurisdiction. We'll of course continue to track that big development but for the moment we're shifting our focus to the other big story.